been the best. And I've just been so excited, and I was so excited to hear you're coming, Cal, and I thank you from the bottom of my heart. Um, two years ago, I heard your song, and at that time, I knew it was going to be a very special part of this. And then uh, Derek sent it to me again, and I said, yeah, I heard that song. I, I really want to incorporate that into our spa day. And Sharon said, uh, or Derek had said, well, Sharon works with him. And I said, what? <laughs> And I looked at her and we were talking and she came over again another week later or so and I looked at her and I said, you know, I was thinking and she said, the email sent. <laughs> and that's how she's connected already we it. are. She's already good. She'd already sent the email and <coughs> how graciously obliged. Um, I want to share a bit about Cal. I hope I don't screw it up so you can just fill me in. <laughs> he won awards at the SCMA this year. He, uh, okay. <laughs> he was nominated for five but won three, so you won best song of the year, correct? And that was for? A song called Beautiful Sound. It's beautiful. <laughs> and then um, uh, then you got to fill me in, Cal. I, I'm mixing it up with the other two that you were nominated. I don't. I don't. <laughs> Come on, Cal. You got my album? album? My album won album of the year. Yes. And that song, Beautiful Sound, won song of the year and single of the year. Yes, and there you go. So, and so he's going to sing When Pink is Just the Color again, and it's just a beautiful song. And if I haven't had uh, the opportunity to let share, did you have a chance, Jesse, to listen to it? Yeah. Yep. So I passed it on as much as I could. I want to thank everybody for being here today. And uh, when Cal's done singing, we will start with Mom's balloon, and then we'll release the rest, okay? Sorry. It's okay. Thank you. Well, thank you, for, thank you for having me, and thank you for... Uh, putting on this event for the last 10 years. You guys all need to be... No, it's just six. <laughs> just six. Six, okay. Um, and it's my pleasure to be here. Thanks for thanks for having me. I, the uh, most important song that I've ever written in my life is when pink is just the color again. And uh, I am I am just uh, waiting to hear the final mix of, a, of, the, of the song. Uh, I'm releasing this song to radio, both uh, country radio and uh, pop station, Z99 station. So I've got two different Lady. versions of it. Um, it has been an incredible song for me. I get emails daily from all over the world. Um, got an email this morning from a girl in Kentucky that wants to wants her brother to learn how to play so she can sing it at an event that their family Aww. is having. So I email them the, the lyrics and the chords and stuff for them for them to do it. But uh, it is it has been an incredible uh, uh, song for me. But the most incredible thing is that I wrote it because breast cancer has uh, really affected my family. <laughs> and uh, I've had uh, a lot of family members uh, battle cancer and my godmother lost the fight and uh, I grew up very close to her her daughters my cousins um, and uh, saw everything that everybody was was going through the whole and I was very very close to that you know I, um, my wife and I drove to Calgary when, when my auntie Debbie was uh, you know saying we were all saying goodbye to her and, and uh, that was six years before I wrote this song and it was always something inside me and, and uh, I sat down with a good friend of mine his name is Brent Baxter and we just started talking and, and uh, it took us a couple days but we wrote when pink is just a color and when it seems like the whole town is here friends and ribbons fill the park she knows she's not alone, it makes her smile, it breaks her heart. Daughter is holding her hand, a balloon tied on her wrist. She says, Mommy, everyone's dressed in pink, look how pretty it is. And it reminds her of coming here when she was just a little girl. Holding her own mother's hand, it was an innocent world. When pink was just a color and ribbons tied back in, and every race was just for fun, and we ran without a care. Today is one step closer. Like back when pink 
is just a color again. Now her daughter's on grandpa's shoulders waving above the crowd. She steps up to the starting line and takes a long Posters held up high, white candles being lit. Mothers and daughters, sisters and wives that are being missed. But her mother is still with her as a picture on her shirt. She wipes away bittersweet tears and she runs in memory of her.